Building Smart is the worldwide industry body driving the digital transformation of the built asset industry, committed to delivering improvement by the creation and adoption of open, international standards and solutions for infrastructure and buildings. Building Smart is an open, neutral and international not-for-profit organization. And with a global community of chapters, members, partners and sponsors, it's enabling better collaboration and digital workflows through the solutions and standards it delivers. Building Smart International is incredibly well known in the built asset industry because we've developed open standards and services to support all the organisations that contribute to that and uh, the end users that use some of those standards and services so brilliantly on their projects. The Building Smart exists because uh, we want to enable digital transformation. We're committed to promoting open data formats um, for all the players in the built asset industry, to so all the people involved in an asset's life. Um, and that means that they will be able to have the right information, you know, the information they need at the right time. Building Smart International visited Lombardi Engineering Limited, a Swiss civil engineering company, to discuss how they use open standards, open BIM, and how they translate these into real world projects. As a BSI member, Lombardi deliver first class tunneling projects and an open BIM approach. Dr. Lombardi founded the company in 1955. We are uh, active in a lot of countries, Switzerland, but also Europe and LATAM and India and Australia. We are in the main two core businesses. The one is uh, tunneling and the other one is uh, all together with water, hydropower delivery systems. Those are our two core businesses. Operation and maintenance is becoming really important for, for our clients. If you don't have standards, you don't uh, get what the, the other company, the other person is saying. So it's, it's a, a common language we need in the infrastructure. Otherwise, uh, we will never go further. For us, working with the Buildings International and IFC standard is really important uh, because uh, we need to use this uh, exchange information format uh, in order to put our uh, designing and construction data into the model and deliver it uh, at the client to, in order to be reused for the operation and maintenance phase. For Lombardi, it's really important to be uh, able to manage the digital destiny of the company and of its client. Uh, we know that technology runs very fast and uh, we need to be faster than, <laughs> than it. So uh, we have uh, two departments that take care of uh, research and development. One uh, is linked to the academic world and uh, has been founded by Mr. Giovanni Lombardi several years ago. And one is this uh, strategic digital unit. They take care of the development of workflow and uh, standard documentation uh, regarding the use of BIM. Building Smart is crucial to one of Lombardi's current projects, the Tremazina Variante. This is an underground road diversion project that aims to alleviate congestion in the small coastal town of Como. Going to visit a live construction site with Lombardi and Anas, the operator from Italy, is incredibly exciting for me because it's one of the first times we're able to connect some of the theoretical standards that we've developed over these many years, some of the supporting services that we're developing into a real world project. The Tremazina Variante is made up of four main tunnels running mostly underground for a total length of about 10 kilometers. As the designer, Lombardi is using an open BIM approach to ensure good collaboration, design review and flexibility with other stakeholders and the client, ANAS, the national road operator in Italy. Well, the biggest challenge is the, the reduced space we have in this area. We deal with very few square meters of land and uh, the machine and all the equipment for the underground excavation must be fit in the very close space. And also there are very uh, peculiar points in which the tunnels are close to each other, so we have to be careful right there. 
it is really important to uh, use the BIM method in order to uh, check before we go on the construction site where we have a very restricted time of construction because we impact a lot on the on the way on the roadway uh, so we need to be sure that the planning and all the technical uh, uh, issues are very well set up and uh, no variations could happen during the construction phase open beam is working really well in this project because it allows us to be able to collaborate with other companies that are not working with the same software as ours because they are working in different disciplines or in different fields of the same discipline. So having an open beam approach and an FC way of doing stuff, it allows us to collaborate with them without any troubles. This project has created confidence in the open BIM design work for ANAS, a company that manages over 30,000 kilometers of road in Italy and over 1,800 bridges, among other work. They also see the benefit of open BIM and want to drive more projects in the future. ANAS, uh, for us, is very important to obtain uh, correct data to use uh, in, uh, during the maintenance and uh, this is uh, my principal work, uh, my principal job to check this data, uh, to define the rule uh, uh, how this data should be used uh, uh, during the construction sites and uh, during the, the maintenance. Building smart standards is very important for us because uh, we can uh, manage a lot of information uh, obviously, in this project was uh, very hard for us, but uh, that's simple. Um, we, we can manage a lot of information properly in a simple way. With clients asking for more open BIM readiness and recognizing the need for IFC standards, Lombardi have found themselves in a leading position to provide these skills as part of the Building Smart community. We are at the Colonna portal, the southern end of this alignment. And uh, you can see behind me the excavation in which there will be the three entrances of the tunnel, the main tunnel, the service tunnel, and the Colonna diversion. You can see the very challenging area due to the reduced space. And uh, the excavation will take place at that change. I'm very excited to be here after we work a lot of time to the model, to see the construction site and we see the develop in real time about the construction site and to, uh, we check the, the develop of this after many days work in, uh, in the model and now it's very uh, exciting to see the, the real construction site. Well, it's fantastic to be on site and see the theory being put into practice. Tunnelling projects have always been difficult, but uh, this one uh, looks to be even more challenging than most because of the tight uh, constraints of the site. The uh, digital approach that they're taking with the design, I think, is uh, informing how they're managing their logistics. It's also informing how they're managing the decisions regarding the geological uh, excavations and the um, access for the design tunnels. So to me, this looks like it's a, a really challenging site. In what ways has the digital approach to help you overcome some of the problems? The digitalization and virtualization of this uh, kind of items permit to anticipate the big problem that is the interchange here, the main point of, of this part. And in the office, you have this part modeled and you can study it better. So not only have IFC standards and Open BIM enabled Lombardi to deliver the detailed and strategic design needed for this particular project, they're also helping to win more projects and to deliver trust and confidence with their clients. BD Smart International uh, has helped uh, just uh, in the last tender uh, Lombardi to win a uh, new tender because, uh, for example, uh, clients are now asking us how do you want to approach 
your project using the Open BIM uh, standard. We are developing all our standards in an Open BIM approach because uh, we trust that this is the only way that we can go in the future with the development of digitalization also in our company. Working with Lombardi, Building Smart and Open BIM uh, gets us a lot of confidence.